Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy YCV, man. Look, I know it's been a little while. Um, I've been getting acclimated to my new job. I finally am now, so the content is going to continue on as usual. Um, I, I'm a little sick right now. Just, just my sinuses all are all over the place. All right. Uh, I don't know if you can hear it in my chest. I'm mad congested, but I feel okay besides like the congestion now. And no, I don't have COVID, but um, yeah, just want to get that out of the way. If I cough when I laugh, then <laughs> then you know why. So I wanted to make this make a quick video, right? Because I actually I actually saw this on Hollywood Unlocked, and I thought this would be hilarious to talk about. I didn't listen to it, but I saw the uh, pretty much the headline, and I was like, I got to talk about this. So the headline says Kevin Samuels says black women's biggest enemy is hispanic women now we are go we look we're gonna hear him out we're gonna hear him out because i think i may have an idea of why he's saying that i i may i'm not sure what he's gonna say but um let's let's just let's just go ahead and get into it and keep in mind guys i do not know the full context of this conversation this is only from one clip so let's just go ahead and get into it all right don't a lot of women black women need to understand something that your biggest enemy is not a white woman your biggest problem is not 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 a white woman your biggest enemy is marisol <laughs> Your biggest enemy is the Hispanic woman. This nigga said Marisol. She understands how to season food. She understands sensuality, femininity, and she was raised in a patriarchal environment. The difference between femininity and fake femininity is amazing. The Latina problem. Black women, you have a problem. Her name is Maria. Marisol. <laughs> Love some brothers, and if you notice, they are the old. Go go to the old black side of town, and you will see Hispanics. And the difference used to be the Hispanic men and the men, because a lot of okay. sisters don't. A lot of women, so black women need. So that's that's pretty much the clip, right? So as you guys, I, I don't I don't know. Let's let's unpack this a little bit, shall we? All right. So I'm not even gonna hold you. Um, I thought at first he was saying this mainly because uh and guys i'm not going to speak in like totalities or anything like that but i'm just going to go off of the things that i've noticed uh with my time being on this earth and me being around other black men as well so it seems like a lot of the time a lot of black men uh prefer hispanic women like a, a lot i mean i personally don't give a fuck as long as i think you're attractive and you know you cool to vibe with i don't care if you yellow blue orange i i don't give a fuck all right but i know a lot of black men who specifically go out and fetishize latina women just because ooh, they got attitudes they spicy all that other shit right <clears throat> but i just i just find it funny here's here's why i have a problem with it right um, I understand if you, you, you like what you like, okay, fine. I don't have a problem with that. But the only thing that I have a problem with is that they will put up with issues from Hispanic women, but not black women. So I've, I'll never forget this uh, conversation that I had with a couple of my boys saying they love how, how crazy, you, you know, they're, uh, you know, his, Hispanic women are and they do this and, and they do that. But if a black woman were to do the same thing, then yo, yo, they, they angry, they savages, they this and that and blah, blah, blah. Just another angry black woman. Right. So Hispanic woman to me gets a whole lot of passes and black women just gets put they, they just get put on the back burner per usual so that's my issue that's why i thought he was going with this but it's fucking Cam kevin samuels like what, what the hell was i thinking your biggest enemy is the hispanic woman she understands how to season food okay let's <laughs> let's just let let's just stop right there <laughs> what the fuck kind of argument is this uh, your problem is not the white is not the white woman it's the hispanic woman because she knows how to season food first of all i have not run into a lot of black women who do not know how to season food bro 
Are you saying that black women can't season food? That's fucking silly. But I mean, whatever. That's hilarious. She understands sensuality, femininity, and she was raised in a patriarchal environment. Okay, she understands. I d all right, so I don't I don't mind Kevin Samuels because a lot of the time he tells the truth, but I disagree with him here. He says they know sensuality and femininity. So I now he's actually speaking in, in totalities because I know some hard ass, you know, Hispanic woman out here, bro. I'm 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 just saying, uh that's not necessarily true. And I don't understand why black women aren't looked at as sensual or, or feminine. Like this is this is a horrible rhetoric that has been going on for fucking years and it needs to stop. I I don't get it. He's not necessarily basing this off of anything. And I know he said now one thing that he said that is pretty that is kind of true. Um if you're Hispanic, let me know if this is true in the comments down below. All right. But from the Hispanic friends that I have or, or had or any interactions that I had in the past, um, the household did seem like somewhat of of a patriarchy, right? Like the man brings home the bacon, like blah blah blah. Just regular old like regular schmegular degular the man brings home the bacon societal bull crap right um that seemed to be true so but niggas aren't thinking about that <laughs> so i don't know what kevin Samuels is talking about because niggas aren't thinking about that they just see hey this is pretty hispanic woman and, and i want to smash niggas not thinking about that shit like oh she come from a patriarchy i want to be with her nah 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 i I don't know, man. Ah, let's 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 keep going. The difference between femininity and fake femininity is amazing. The Latina problem. Black women, you have a problem. Her name is Maria. <laughs> Marisol. Love some brothers. And if you notice, they are the old go go to the old black side of town and you will see Hispanics. And the difference used to be the Hispanic men and the men because of okay all right, all right yeah i can't say i'm i'm with you on this one kevin um you're speaking in totality dude not not all hispanic women like black dudes actually a lot of them <laughs> would rather not fuck with black men at all because there is a horrible stigma behind us you know we we don't work we're lazy we we cheat we're criminals just like kind of like how you're putting a stigma on black women there's already a stigma on on us as well so i know a lot of a lot of uh, hispanic women that never dated black women because their parents didn't want them to so that's not true i don't like when people make these type of arguments and they put these totalities in there like oh yeah all hispanic women. they they love them some brothers they love them some goddamn niggas that is not true that is not true i know so i met a hispanic chick that said if you are not of hispanic descent i do not want you i want somebody from my own culture and that's fine and that's fine i i hear you but <clears throat> to say that they all like like black and, and keep in mind liking black penis is not the same thing is is liking you know black men in general everybody like who the fuck doesn't like black penis all right what what women what woman does not like black penis come on come on now i'm just saying but i'm gonna have to disagree with kevin samuels on this one i just <laughs> that shit just was hilarious when he said your problem is not the white woman it's marisol this man said marisol <laughs> that's hilarious i don't know guys let me know what you think in the comments down below do you think that kevin is speaking facts or do you think he's full of it or he just doesn't know what he's talking about at all. Please do me a favor. Let me know in the comments down below. And if you enjoyed this video, then please do me a favor. Subscribe. Give me a like. Come on, man. It's Christmas. This is the season of giving, goddammit. So come on. Give. Give. I, I give you the content. You give me the subscription and the like. That's all I'm asking for. That's all I'm asking for. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, oh, quick announcement. Uh, the Discord will be up on Christmas Eve. Um... I am basically making a Discord so I can create a community that's centered around my YouTube channel so you guys can, you know, have a more personal connection with me. A lot of you send me video suggestions and, and video topics, things to talk about. So instead of hitting me in my, you know, my DMs, you can do that in a Discord. So starting Christmas Eve, the Discord will be up. I already have a few of my homies in there, um, but I'm going to let you guys know 
by that time i'm gonna have it you know done up real pretty like and, and, and stuff uh but yeah i'll make an announcement on my community page so be on the lookout for that and as always do not forget to share like and subscribe it really helps out the channel and i appreciate you guys all right and with that being said i'm out it's your boy ycv peace